Hey everyone, welcome to Denver Synth by channel. Yo, I'm Sabina. My name is Alex. And today we're watching fourth episode of the first season of Overlord. The plot thickens and we already start to realize how complex the world, but I believe that our Lord Ainz gonna figure everything out and eventually conquer everything that he sees. Yes, and Lord Mamongo is still trying to understand how powerful he is in this world, so we'll see. And I want to remind you that we have a Patreon channel, so if you're interested in early access, full uncut reactions, please join us there. Link in the description. Let's get it started. Yay! <laughs> Oh yeah, this dude is actually from the second episode. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. So that guy is serving some of the six gods that exist in that world. Ooh, we have interesting look. Mm -hmm. Slain theocracy. They came after him. Mm -hmm. That was fast. It's like that's what happens when you decline the request. そして Oh, that's nice. Could be cool to explain what is this. I guess he knows. Ainz様。なぜ戦士長様は出て行かれるのでしょう? Mm -hmm. So it was a strategic move. Okay, good luck, dude. Ooh. A magic shield. I mean, his head were not for nothing. But yeah, even he struggles. Mm -hmm. What sort of Evangelion is this? <laughs> Okay, he's using magic as well. Aha, uh -huh, nice. nice. Okay, minus one. Is it? Yeah, they want to save the villagers. Oh. <laughs> Oh no. Yeah, good guys, but dead guys. Yeah, if you kill the puppeteer, all of them will die. Mm -hmm. He knows some cool moves. It is. Yeah, he's losing. Yeah, too many of those creatures. Mm -hmm. They're all long ranged and they're flying. Uh, it's sad, but looks like he's gonna die. Mm. Maybe Lord Ainz will show up. 
Not for him. But I guess in future Lord Hines needs to fight those two. For sure. He still didn't use that gift a Lord Tynes gave him. True. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so that's what it was. It's like a substitution. Oh. Wow. That's what the thing for. Nice. Looks like it's one time use. Okay, somebody heal that man. Now it probably will be more challenging than some. First, second tire soldiers. Oh, for sure. The first, it has weird eyes. The first boss. Yes, sir. お前たちはこの私が手間をかけてまで救った村人を殺すと公言していたな。これほど深いなことがあるものか。天使たちを突撃させよ。Oh. <laughs> It's nothing. So only magical attacks are working on him. Mm, that's cool. Okay, show them. <laughs> Wow, that's impressive. Yeah, retreat, man. Yeah, that's him. <laughs> mm -hmm. あの程度の飛び道具でこの身が傷つかないのは承知のはず。お待ちください、アインス様。地高の海と戦うのであれば最低限度の攻撃というものがございます。あのように下戦な飛び粒ってなど。それを言ったらあいつら自体が失格では
これがダメージを負う感覚痛みかうわあっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくっくブラックホールファイアマジック、ブラックホール、ネクロマンシー、ヒーズユーズンエブリティン。わお。マジンをも超える力。お前は一体何者なんだアインズオルゴンだよ。この名はかつて、知らぬ者がいないほど轟いていたのだがね。な、何が何らかの情報系魔法を使ってお前を監視しようとした者がいたみたいだな。本国が俺を。Probably do. では遊びはこれくらいにしよう。まあ、まあ、まあ、待って待ってほしい。アインズウルコンドのいや、サマー私たちいや、私だけで構いません。Nope. あなた間違ってる。Nope. 人間という加藤生物であるあなたたちは。加藤。確かこうだったな。せめてもの情けに、苦痛なく殺してやる。And peaceful music. <laughs> After you killed everyone. Nice evening. 合格点に達していたのだろうか。Of course it was. You are Lord. You can do whatever you want. どうしたアルベド。いえ、何も。しかし、アインス様。なぜあの人間を助けたのですか、mm-hmm. oh, she's talking about the head w a r r i o r、mm-hmm. 私が相当してくればよろしかったのでは何もアイン様が直接加藤生物を助けに行かれなくともアルベドの強さは知っているし信頼しているしかしこの世界の知識がないうちはだからあの男を捨て駒に使ったんですねまさに人間の使い方としては正しいかとですが天使の剣をその身で受けたのはよろしい行為ではなかったのではそうか愛する方に刃物が突き刺さることを容認できる女がいるでしょうかあはい<笑>帰るか我が家へはいアイン様まずは私が個人で勝手に動いたことを詫びよう何があったかはアルベドから聞くようにただ一つだけ至急伝えるべきことがあるこれより私の名を呼ぶときはアインズウルゴウアインズと呼ぶがよい異論あるものは立ってそれを示す No Lord m a m o n g anymore Damn I just learned how to pronounce it 思考の恩方に私どもの全てを捧げます恐るべき力の王よ I submit as well 死の支配者オーバーロードに栄光を Who knows? But I mean, for his friends, the second name is something that can be recognized. Be yeah, recognized. you're right. That could be true. That will make more sense. Yeah. Well, I guess we will know a little more about that in the following episodes. For now, he looks like he is one of the strongest creatures for sure.、Mm-hmm. And even seven dire angel is nothing for him. But he said that he kind of felt pain after the spell, but A little. So, starting seventh tire, he already starts at least to take some damage. Very、yeah. little, but at least some. So, we need him to fight somebody from the ninth tire now. And probably that guy who was、uh, casting those angels, he is probably just a tiny boss、mm-hmm. who is working for some people. And he didn't even know that they're watching him. So, he should be some pawn in bigger game. Yeah.、So、probably some godlike creature. In the beginning of this. 
episode, he was talking to some guy looking like a priest in a church. Mm -hmm. So I guess that might be the main dude. Could and be. he was giving him an order what to do next. And maybe he also watched them while the battle. Mm -hmm. So for now, what do we have? So we have Lord Ainz in his castle. We have... Uh, incredible Lord Incre <laughs> Incredible, yes. And we have some country where the headwater is serving. By some reason, some other country wants to eliminate him. Mm -hmm. And those people who want to eliminate him are working under some priest who is working for one of six gods, if I understood it right. Mm -hmm. There is the same time some empire that they try to frame, mm -hmm. so they will start a war. So, yeah, the world kind of starts to develop. Yeah, for right now, these things are clear. And it's really, really interesting. I like how it goes, and I'm pretty sure it's going to develop more and more. This world is super interesting. Mm -hmm. It seems to be very huge. Yeah, yeah. The map that they showed, it was already a bunch of countries. Mm -hmm. And they talked only about two of them. Yeah. About the race of Lord Ainz. Is undead common? That's what I'm wondering. Like, where that character is from? Like, what's his story? Mm -hmm. It would be great if they actually had some episode dedicated just explaining why some characters look like that. Humans, who are they aligned with? Like, what else? Do they have some lizards? Do they have some dwarves, mm -hmm. orcs? They said they have orcs, ogres yeah. as monsters who sometimes attack in the village. So probably they are not very intelligent life forms, mm -hmm. just monsters. So monsters in this world are not intelligent. Still a lot that this show should explain. Yeah, there should be a lot of different races because even humans, they consider as low intelligent creatures. So mm -hmm. like, wow, it's probably a huge field for imagination what different races besides those orcs and humans. So Ooh, yeah. Thank you for watching this episode with us. Like this video if you like it. Subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see our future actions. Leave a comment below what do you think about this episode, but no spoilers, and see you next one. See you.